Hey what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video on the channel today. Today guys we have episode number 3 of the Road to Glory. Now as you can see on the screen we have a new SBC that we have completed. Uh, I've picked up most of these players uh, fairly cheap. Uh, if I didn't pick them up then I had them in my club already. Um, so this one was fairly cheap to do. It was uh, the Give Me 5 SBC. Uh, which was for a which pack was it? I can't remember. It was a prime mixed players pack, so it's like a half of a 50k pack, is it? No, no, it's a mixed players pack. Sorry, my bad. Anyway, thank you guys for the support on the series so far. I really appreciate it. Um, I am probably going to be changing it to a normal road to glory instead of a pack only road to glory. I've looked at the results on the Twitter poll and YouTube poll, and it seems like more, most people want just a normal road to glory, which I think I will be doing. Uh, so from episode 4 onwards you'll see a normal road to glory only and that's how I'm going to do the series just because I think progressing with the pack only is going to take a while uh, so I think a normal road to glory will be easier. Anyway, I'm going to jump into a live highlight now of some squad battle rewards. Right guys, as you can see here we have some squad battle rewards to claim. Uh, I didn't actually manage to play many games so I only ended up in gold 3. As you can see on the screen, we do get a Prime Mix Players Pack and a Jumbo Premium Gold Pack and 10,000 coins. So those coins can probably just get used in for uh, our um, like SBCs and stuff like that. So <clears throat> a Prime Mix Players Pack is what we're going to open first. Again, all I'm asking for is players that are just usable for the team. So the board's coming out. Is that going to be anything good? I don't think so, but it's going to be a rare gold striker from... I don't know where that is, what, I don't know what club that is, but Boateng, 91 pace, could be useful off the bench. Anything else? Rojo and a Watford right back is actually really good uh, for us, because those are upgrades to the current team. Uh, two quick wingers there. Uh, anything else? I don't think these guys will sell. Oh wow, that guy actually does sell. Why is that guy so expensive? I'm just going to list that guy up for 8k. Uh, uh, we'll keep the rest and we move on into the final pack for our squad battle rewards jumbo premium gold pack there uh, this is a 15k pack I'm pretty sure uh, once what's promo is on obviously is that going to be anything good? no it's going to be a gold rare left mid Rafa 93 pace 82 rated not too bad again doesn't really fit up into the setup and neither do really any of these players not gonna lie. Um, you Spanish League players again. These are probably gonna be used for SPCs or something like that. Does this guy sell for anything? No. I mean, again, SPC uh, players. There. I'm just gonna get rid of all of this because we don't need it. We're gonna keep that. So we're up to fifteen thousand coins, and I also have something in the foundations SPC, which is transfer market list an item. Oh wow. Okay. 150 coins for that. Uh, what I'm going to try and do also on this account uh, is the one to watch Indombele now just because he's untradeable and I, it would be great for us to have a player like this so um, I've nearly done this one with the rivals one we get a premium gold pack for that as well I'm going to try and do that now and add that pack in the episode as well um, win four rival matches with at least two French players in again that's it doesn't have a min minimum difficulty so that's fairly easy uh, this one's probably the one that's going to take a long time. Uh, also, this one assist ten, basically get ten assists in ten different games with people that have the default position in midfield, uh, and then pinpoint accuracy. I only need to do one more, uh, which is all good. So hopefully, I'll be able to get this in Don Bele card soon. Uh, and I also need to qualify for the weekend league. Now, if we go and look, I haven't actually got any points at this moment. It's currently Monday night, um, the week of the first weekend league. Uh, so I'm going to just try and grind out and get qualified for you guys. I'll show you some highlights of rivals in between episodes and stuff like that. Uh, and all that good stuff. So by the time you see this episode, this will be the day after the weekend league. So on the Monday, I do believe. So yeah, that's how I'm, I'm going to do Monday episodes and also uh, Thursday episodes for the Road to Glory. So I'm going to do two a week. And then have my career mode uh, stuff in between that. So we're going to jump into some squad battles and division rivals. I'll probably show some highlights of that as well. So I'll see you guys in a second. 
Alright guys, we've got some packs here right now. As you can see, we have a gold pack, premium gold pack, premium gold 13 pack. I got these from uh, doing some objectives for the Ndombele card. Uh, who are we going to get? Well, at least we get a rare player here. It is going to be... I mean, that's not a board or anything, is it? No, but we do get a centre-back French Dallo. That's actually not a bad player to pack. Um, that gives us options for the French League. And we get we get Champions, Champions League Christiansen. What the hell? What the hell? I mean, I will take that. I will take that. I'm going to take a screenshot of that. I'm going to upload that to my Twitter. Anyway. Um, don't need that. Don't need that. That is a really good pack. Two really good centre-backs there. I will take that. Emerson, Christiansen can link up to Emerson. Now we've got a gold... 13 pack as well. What are we going to get? Don't get a rare player, unfortunately. So we're going to skip that one. Who are we going to get? Oh, that. Oh, two very good upgrades for our Premier League team. I will take that every day of the week. Don't need that. Uh, we'll keep that. So I'm going to jump into the squad now um, to update the team. As you guys can also see, from that um, pack we got before for our squad battles, the Salford, uh, Salford left back sold for 8,000 coins on a buy now. Um, so I don't know who was buying that card, but yeah, uh, I'm happy with that. So, as you can see, Longstaff can finally come out of the team. I'll just whack him there for Austin, uh, and I'll get rid of Austin by doing that. Andre Gomez can come in, and then we can go to Matt Ryan. He's actually He was actually pretty good for me. Uh, we'll swap them for Scott Dan, take Scott Dan out, and search for Dubarak, uh, Dubarak, however you pronounce his name. And then Cook, unfortunately, mate, I know you were only here for a short time, but Christiansen is going to come in. Uh, I'm going to put him in there, like that. And as you can see, the team is looking much better now. Obviously, I've got to give players contracts and crack on with our division rivals. So, again, really good few packs. Look at the team already. It's not too bad. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to do some more challenges, div rivals, squad battles and stuff like that. I'll probably add a game or two onto the end of this video and then we'll probably wrap it up there. So I'll see you guys in the next clip. Right guys, as you can see here, we have got another SPC to complete. It is the Around the World one, which is basically uh, one league with 10 different nationalities. Uh, so I chose the, op the option of using the Syria. Um, shout out to Pieface for uh, giving me this team. Basically, I just seen one of his videos on his Road to Glory, and this was the team he submitted. So I just copied it, and it only cost me like 10k. So I, uh, for a 50k pack for 10,000 coins, I won't complain. So we're gonna open the pack here. Hopefully, we can get something good. Um, obviously, when I seen that, I was like, oh, it's, a, it's gonna be a board. Um, so it was a board in fact, German goalkeeper, and I was like, oh, who could this be? And I was like, oh, Leno, that's actually very good for us because our team uh, is obviously one of the teams, or the main team uh, at this point was Premier League based. Obviously, like I said in the, uh, at the start of the video, I'm going to do, go to a normal road to glory now. So pulling a Leno was really, really good for us at that point. Uh, obviously, he probably will still be our goalkeeper for now. Uh, even when we do shift over to a normal road to glory. We also got Nabi Keita in there and Joe Gomez and Yedlin who all went straight into my team So it was really really good to see another one here This was one of the one to watch SBCs which came out the wan Basaka's move or on the move. I picked up everyone. Well, I had Everyone else in the club apart from a 950 coin silver and a 3000 coin Jesse Lingard So a bit overpriced for the pack um, Which I probably shouldn't have done at the stage of when I did it it was only for a uh, half of a 50k pack, so a small pre uh, goal, premium, oh, was it a small rares player pack or something like that. So we opened the pack up, um, didn't actually get anything really good. So we skipped that and I moved in, it was Naldo was the best player. Again, was he worth it? Was it worth it? Not really, to be honest. Uh, we lost quite a bit of coins on that. I think I just ended up keeping every player in the club anyway, uh, ju just for SBCs and stuff. But anyway... Rodri's transfer was the next one to watch um, SBC that was out and boy did this pay out this did this paying off that Jesse Lingard for 3,000 coins to get a Naldo has completely been worth it after this um, obviously you've seen the players there they were like silver and bronze and low rated golds so we did, all we got from this was literally a 7.5k pack for doing an SBC which we had all the players in the club apart from maybe a couple if that 
open up the pack I was not expecting much you know uh, at least I seen the uh, nice um, boards there and it slowly opened now I seen that uh, one little thing I seen Argentina and I shit myself I honestly thought I was gonna get Messi but nonetheless we got Dybala 88 rated at this point I was obviously so happy because obviously pack only road to glory and getting Dybala is just insane uh, I think at the time of recording this uh, talk over I think he's around 100k maybe or, or just over so let me know in the comment section below if you think I should sell Dybala and take the coins and build on a uh, better team because obviously now we're going to go normal road to glory so should I keep Dybala or should I and build a team around him or should I sell him and go down the route of trying to build another team I, I don't know if I'm going to sell like my whole club and just build up a load of coins and just go on with that and see if I can pick up some good teams and good players we've still got 3000 coins in that pack which is really nice to see so again what I did do at this point I went over to the squad just to put Dybala in there uh, as you can see that was the Premier League team we had at the moment uh, we went into squad select I think and we built like a Calcio A um, team as you can see uh, basically what I did I put um, every of the, like one of the big leagues in um, in like a concept squad or of the players that I already had in the club so Dybala went straight into this um, in this team and as you can see I was only I was only a couple of players away from having a, an okay base uh, team here so as you can see Syria we've got a better goalkeeper there and we've got a better centre mid as well so uh, that those players do go into the side uh, as actually I don't think the centre mid did because he wasn't as good as the other centre mids that I had um, so yeah I kept him away and so yeah if you look at that team it's actually not that bad but I'm not too sure what I want to do in terms of a team let me know some suggestions on uh, beast players, OP players or leagues that you think are good on this FIFA um, it would be greatly appreciated because I am not too sure what I want to do because I want to sell uh, my club and get as many coins as possible and build the best team I can uh, obviously normal road to glory just opening SBCs and opening rewards no FIFA points uh, so I am struggling on ideas I am going to grind over the weekend uh, unfortunately I'm going to miss the first weekend league because I didn't have time to qualify uh, but we're going to go into a live section now of my division rival awards for the first week of FIFA alright guys to end the episode off here I've got division rival awards for the first week of the division rivals obviously this week I didn't really get much chance to play on this account um, so that's why we're quite uh, low down uh, I'm going to take these rewards and we are going to have premium gold pack and a jumbo premium gold pack. So it's actually not too bad. Um, just hopefully we can get some players that are usable again uh, to improve our team. So first one is going to be a rare player. That is going to be a board. Is that... Who's this? Greece, centre-back. Manolas or Socrates? Socrates. Now that can, he can go straight in our team actually. 84 rated Socrates is not a bad pull from silver... What was it? Silver 1 um, rewards? In a 7.5k pack. Oh, and it actually goes for 12k as well. That is a really good pack. I am happy with that. And um, we will keep all of that and get rid of that. Moving on to the last pack. Jumbo Premium Gold Pack. 15k pack now. Can we get a rare? Yes, we can. What are we going to get in this one? It's not going to be a walkout or a board. It is going to be left wing Diata. Okay, not great. Let's be honest, not great. Um, but again we've got some players that could well no one's really going gonna go in our team they're probably more SBC players and um, we also get a thousand coins at the end which I will happily take confirm those now before we end the episode I'm gonna go jump into the squads as you can see there 19k coins the Gomez and I'll probably take out um, Christensen for him can I not um, put him in. Why is that happening? Oh, there you go. So, apart from yeah, apart from passing and dribbling, Christensen, Christensen is better. So, I'm gonna put Socrates in. I'll put Christensen on the bench for uh, I don't know Jinyak, for example. So that's how the team is looking right now. It's not actually that bad. Uh, right for I'll put Joe Gomez on that side. He's got a better weak foot. So. That is the team, guys. Oh, the uh, some areas where we can improve. Uh, definitely another centre mid, a striker, uh, probably the, maybe the CDM and Cam, maybe. Um, but obviously, as you see, we've got the Beast Dybala. He will he's put into our other team. 
uh, which we haven't got completed yet, the Serie A team. I'll try and maybe get a hybrid going if that's possible, not too sure if it is. But anyway guys, that's going to end the episode off. If you did enjoy, please leave a like, comment and subscribe if you're new around here. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace!